good right here. Sorry again about what happened to Sammy and Ellis. Appreciate it. Motherfucker, you look like the cat who ate the canary. This here's our first step toward breaking Marcano and taking over the city. I hear what y'all got to say, but I decide who gets the turf. And in the end, my decision is final. Is this a goddamn joke? Uh, look, I know you knew you were calling the shots, but... My guys are working that action as we speak. So where's the fucking question? From where I'm sitting, it looks like you already got a plan for this part of the city. This is the first I'm hearing of this shit. So I figure you got your plans worked out, but goddamn, you know how to get these white boys riled up. The sit down. You've already assigned the rackets in this district, but now you must assign this district to one of my underbosses, and all bets are off. Deciding who will run this district will reassign its rackets to your chosen underboss. Assigning a district to one of my underbosses will unlock more favors and improve the amount of kickback I'll collect while making them more loyal to you. Underbosses might resent not getting a district, which could have consequences down the road, but if you really want to get the most out of any single underboss, you'll need to make the hard choices. I'm all for making a big statement right out of the gate. Uh, fucking probably duh. You need duh. to show me you serious about working together. So far, I ain't seen shit. What's the- We got a long road ahead of us. Don't make the wrong first step, lad. Give me more adrenaline. Inside man. Oh, I lose those. And with Burke, I get explosive supply, bribing the cops, a silenced deacon. I get it. You know I can handle this. I get switchboard operator and a gunsmith for increased ammo. <laughs> mm, I'm going Never veto. An easy answer. Trust me, I know. It's gotta be you. Like, duh, you're the obvious obvious choice. About fucking time. Always knew you had a good head on your shoulders. I guess that's that. And make sure you don't fuck it up. Y'all can sit out the next one, cause I'll be damned if it ain't coming to me. We're done for now. You'll hear from me if I need you. Oh, and then the game just crashes. That's... annoying. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. What a prick. I gotta go. Thank you for this. Happy hunting, Donovan. <sighs> Miss Lancaster's helping me with a side project. You get a name at Enzo? Yeah, Remy Duval. He's not only building the casino, he also owns all the land where it's being built. Remy Duval? The jackass on the radio? His family's been down here a couple hundred years. Thinks it makes him everyone's massa. According to this, he heads up the Southern Union in his spare time. The Southern Union's basically the fucking clan. You know, right before I shipped out, Father James was with some other folks protesting the fact that the city didn't have any black cops. Southern Union came in and kicked the shit out of everybody they could get their hands on. Day after, they spray painted, God hates niggers across the front of his church. If President Andrew Johnson had actually executed those traitorous fucks, we wouldn't have this goddamn problem. Enzo also mentioned Olivia Marcano. Olivia's an outlier. Old Southern money. She's the one that was married to Sal's brother, Lucho. At least until someone slit his throat. And she runs Frisco Fields. Ever since Lucho died. She expanded his drug business and opened a PCP lab. Hmm. And since a lot of mafiosos live up there, she probably just has a place they can socialize. Well, it's usually in the back of some business. I never knew the mob had women as capos. She's there to keep Duval in line. Only people these entitled pricks listen to were other entitled pricks. So who are you going to go after first? Duval. Since he owns the land where the casino's being built, killing him will muddy things up. You think hitting Olivia's businesses will help draw him out? I've known racist assholes like him my entire life. Black man like me running around terrorizing white folks. He ain't going to be able to let that stand. His pride will bring him down. Hey, you know that bourbon's not cheap. Good luck out there.
So we've got... Frisco Fields for the PCP. Unhappy the Irish mob. Bear's ambitions have brought him to the streets of Frisco Fields. There's Frisco Fields itself, which is a Southern Union thing. The compromised corruption. Donovan Zendel revealed the dirt and corruption at the heart of downtown. And that is Donovan's discovered the instant of the good shipping records and tick fall. So these are two new areas. The Boy, I don't know. Hold on. We got New Area, Frisco Fields, PCP in Frisco Fields. That's downtown. That's Tikfa. We still got South South Downs, South Downs, and I presume also the Bayou Phantom, unless this is just like the uh, the area for the repeatables. So there's all that, and then there's this area. Um. So I guess we'll do. We'll we'll, we'll do uh the uh, I I guess PCP. I don't I don't know. <laughs> I think PCP is the uh, the main ish one. That's the um Miss Marcano or whatever it was. Now that Enzo Conti's gotten the fuck out of Dodge, you can head up to Frisco Fields and deal with Sal's Capo Olivia Marcano. Right? Yes. Olivia is more of a necessary evil than a valued family member, but Frisco's home to Marcano and all his mobbed up pals. By hitting her first, you'll shake the new Bordeaux elite at, to their very core. Right, yeah, I want to do that first, I think. Just so we can sort of get this left path done, and then we'll move on to the next ones. So, yeah, that, she's the capital of Frisco Fields. So, sure. And I think she was the PCP one. I think. We'll see. Worst case, we start on some different path and we'll eventually spin back around and, and take out, uh, take out the capos later. Gotta do it all eventually anyway. Uh, do I need ammo and stuff still? Yeah. I'm running low. Yeah. Send supplies to Del Rey Hollow? Arms dealer and the constantly air and all that. Let's get this sorted. Ugh. Talk to you first. Zero dollars a kickback. All right, fine. Let me see what you got. Refill ammo. Give me adrenaline shots. I'll buy a tactical vest. Why not? Whatever. Um, vehicle modifications. Don't have any of these yet. The explosives don't really care too much. Firearms and upgrades. We have a... There's an exclamation mark on stuff. Did we unlock something new? Actually, I think I will uh, swing around and grab the accuracy increases. Yep, 18 grand. And that's all I can do there. And automatic weapons. Assault rifle and SMG accuracy, cool. Rifles, grab the upgrade here. Bang. Oh, we're just short, I think. All right, well, that's fine. We got uh, handguns and automatic weapons, which is uh, mostly what I wanted. And I bought ammo. There we go. Holy shit, that's pinpoint. That's, yeah, that's pretty accurate. All right. <laughs> that might be too accurate. What is the value of these? 42 of 60. That would be, these each would be 40, but I, I... Uh, saved the life of one of the dudes, so we got the extra 2,000 from him. Um, so really that just means that you do less dailies, but the dailies, dailies, listen to me, Jesus Christ. <laughs> repeatables. You do less repeatables, but the repeatables seem to give you enough, like one repeatable maxed out this guy, so really I don't think 2,000 is going to make that much of a difference. It'd still be one or two repeatables to max that out. So... Still siding with it not being very worthwhile doing the junction boxes and saving people, you may as well just kill everybody ever. 
but uh, that's a pretty good amount. It's 42,000 and 42,000, so that's 84,000 on top of the already... Jesus, just 30,000 that he had. Fucking hell. So uh, we'll be getting a lot of kickback out of him. Might be worth doing some of the daily... There we go again. Might be worth doing some of the repeatables to cap these out, because that'll be an extra 40,000, 60,000. So maybe we'll swing around and do that after we take out this capo. Maybe. Not sure. Oh. And also, assets. What did we unlock with him? Nothing yet. At 18,000. Kickback, 2,940. Hmm. Oh, okay, by signing the district, right, I I got it. Because he already had the two rackets there. And I just gave him the district, which ensured that he had the two rackets. So if I had one racket to him, one racket to Burke, and then I assigned this guy the district, it would go, one. the one racket would go from Burke to Vito, but since I gave both rackets to Vito, giving him the district really didn't change anything. So we still just barely have enough for the cool consigliere. And after 40,000 more, we'll be able to get improved stamina and health recovery. Thought it'd be cool. It doesn't say how much improved stamina or health recovery, so it might not be a lot, but... Oh, sorry, I didn't realize there was a car there. <laughs> Damn. And knowing this game and how it's working so far, it'll be a pretty damned good amount. This game seems to not be afraid to give you uh, really potent, powerful things. Which is nice, it makes everything worth doing then that way. Greetings and salutations, and all that shite. Long way from Point Verdun, aren't you, Bear? Decided it was time to branch out. Not really a lot for me in that organization anymore. So what's your new line? Mind-melting narcotics. And I hear the best are coming out of Frisco. PCP, and it's cutting into my business. Okay, so where's the operation? Beats the hell out of me, but a while back, Miss Olivia Marcano hired a top-notch chemist named Bobby Bastian, tasked him with upgrading her operations, which will make it impossible for the small-time cooks to compete. Hell, they even got taxis delivering their shit. If I can get to Bastian's dealers, maybe they'll give him up, tell me something I can use against him. That ain't all. Word is Miss Marcano brought in a couple other eggheads from San Francisco. Get rid of them, and Bobby Bastian's gonna find himself nice and fucked on some of Bastion's guys and maybe they'll tell you something useful. Yep. We've done this kind of thing before, so we'll do the information first thing, because that will, uh, one information, that'll also get rid of this guy, I believe, and give us more shit to do, and then we'll go around slaughtering everybody ever. Taxis. Okay, kill any dealers I find out on the street as well. Nice. So if I find things too difficult, I can just go ahead and do that, which is cool. I do enjoy that. And with our big fuck off truck, I can probably just ram the dealers. Because they're not in a big truck either. It looks like just a standard uh, four door taxi type thing. So I could probably just ram them real good and hard and blow them up that way. There's one! Cut that sack of shit down. That didn't work nearly as well as I wanted it to. Ow. gun while this dude's bleeding out next to me. <laughs> what am I gonna do with you? you better tell me what Bobby Bastion's up to. We've been moving the speed around town using taxis. Last I heard, the boss was keeping the cash drops at the dispatch garage. Nice. Uh, sh kill him. 
Like I said, honestly, if I just do one or two repeatables, it'll max out the place anyway, so that 4,000 really doesn't go as far as you'd think it would. I'd rather just take the money now. Yeah, I was hoping I could, like, smash that and it would, like, be flaming and explode near them. And, oh, my God, it'd be so cinematic and badass. But it wasn't. There's one of their taxis there. I'll ram him. They gave us the location of their drop area so I can get a lot of money there. So we'll go ahead and do that. So, hmm. <laughs> hold on. Hold, hold on a minute, everybody. Oh, there's a hot rod thing over here. Oh, I'm gonna get that. Oh yeah, hot rod. Huh, nice. One and one in Frisco Fields. We got them all. I did it, guys. I got all the collectibles. Yes! <laughs> so I, I assume that drop location. Um Yeah, massive reward, so we'll do that. But I, I think it's too late to have gotten the uh those guys. I thought ramming the vehicle would be doing a shitload more damage, but it really didn't. Makes me kind of sad. So we got the, the Bullworth Mohican here. Honestly, the, the Titan the seems like it's the best. On a lot. Just getting her warmed up. Let's drop it somewhere and I'll run over and grab it when uh, when I get a moment. Appreciate it. Dude, you parked that in like the perfect fucking spot. Well done. All units, right at the Repeat, entrance. To Badass, man. Could've parked a little closer, but I think it did an okay job of blockading. Not bad. And I will swing around by that pawn shop real quick just to see if there's anything left over that I can fuck with you. Still a lot of hostiles in there. We got anyone can call off the cops in Frisco Fields. Right away. Might as well check it out. Poor son of a bitch. Welcome. Sorry about that. Put that back. You there. He came <clears throat> out of nowhere. Go, go, go. Hmm. So the pawn shop that I like rammed the dude into, they like ran over here. I think these are different guys. This is just some area they had set up behind the pawn shop. So like I had very nearly made a delivery to this little place. It looks like it's got a lot of money in it. So that's kind of cool. I find myself just sort of bumbling around and just happening upon all of this stuff. It's pretty interesting. I'm in Frisco Fields and need some new wheels. Just gonna take a squirt and I'll get her out here. Please pull it around over here. Mm. Appreciate it. Yeah, it's not a good spot. Can you deliver another one? I'm in Frisco Fields and need some new wheels. Just gonna take a squirt, and I'll get her out here. I should have paid this voice actor more for more lines. <laughs> uh, with as often as you use this thing, shit. Got a truck for Lincoln Clay. Appreciate yep, it. Thanks, shove. Out of the way, fucker. So we'll do that, and then we can still kill people, right? And we got... 
Oh, that's downtown. That's a completely different uh, area entirely. Looks like just through this gate here. Oh, yeah. There's a fuckload of vehicles over there, man. So we'll just pull up. Block this gate off. Ain't nobody getting through there. It still gives us a spot for cover. And we have easy access for the door. Good shit. Ork. Could just stealth my way on too, but where's the fun on that? Also. Frag out. The hell was that? What happened out there? Quick, somebody go investigate. Still kills me how nobody sees that shit. Is that an explosive tank back? Yeah, it is. There's one here too. There we go. Excellent. And that's like everybody already dead. Beautiful. All the way back there. Awesome. Wow, it is too accurate. Yeah, fucking call help, that's fine. We get shut up! Get down here! Get behind something! Fine, call for backup. There's one way in, and it's right here. Anyone else feel like delivering me ammo? It's much appreciated. I needed more Molotovs and stuff. I, I blocked the truck here for a very good reason. This, this is one of them. This one, admittedly, the less thought of. But, uh, yeah, that works pretty well, because they, they pull up and <laughs> can't make it in, so they just have to run through this door. Did that guy ever call ba uh, calls back up? Did he make it? This is nobody's fault but y'all! Sentry alerted! Oh, alright, fine, whatever. I was okay with you calling for more help. Destruction. Two frags, very nice. Twenty thousand dollars. <gasps> oh God! Look, I know the broads in this neighborhood don't seem like the type to do drugs, but it's super fucking easy. You go up to their door, all polite, like dress in your best suit, and tell them that PCP is a great way for them to slim down. No dieting, no exercise. The pounds just melt away. By the time they figure out it's a crock, they're hooked, and they're we're swimming in money. Right. So I'm hearing just like fairly consistent crashing going on over here. 
Is that the gate breaking against my vehicle or something? Uh. Well, that was interesting. I like that. That was fun. Let's do that again. Hmm, <laughs> Far Cry 4 repeating things. Mm, that was good. Never did much of that, but the fact that you could. Fucking sweet. You could like redo compounds after you did them so you could try to stealth them properly for the achievements and stuff like that. Or just do it again just because the combat in that game was fun fucking nominal. I liked it at least. Just breaking into this guy's house. Oh no, they're just around the back. Oh, that's lame. Huh? Hey, did you? Shouldn't have come here. Looking over here now. Right, enough of that. Say what you gotta say. Jesus Christ. He's so Calm angry down. over there. Calm down. Guard gunfire, blam, 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 shoots up in the air. Damn. Seven fifty there, a note there. Oh, hey, look at this. 1250 there, some to roll up here. What's the note say? Oh my god, that's a long one. Oh, Jesus. We're running low on piperidine, so Mr. Bastion needs you to make another run up to Baton Rouge. Carl's cancer came back, so you'll be dealing with his brother Francis. Francis will probably invite you in for some supper, so don't go back to Lake here in a goddamn hurry. Head on in there, eat his catfish, and come on back. I like this, it's just like some little suburb area, but nobody's fucking here, so it's it's a little strange. Like, there's nobody out for a jog, or nobody inside the houses that you can't go into, so it's just kind of, I don't know, it's weird. This, this big fuck van pulls up, some guy with the gun comes running out, you'd think somebody would raise alarm. Yeah. Next death, uh, over there. Mm, look out, cop! Oh shit. <laughs> that was close, man. And we are here. Seems really easy. There's like not that many people, you know? I know I heard something. Let's just do the job. Yeah. Somebody here. Oops, I want to do the hold Q thing out of cover. You like let go of control and go right into holding Q, because you can't just do it straight out of cover. But uh, I fucked it up. Fuck off over there. TVA here reminds me a lot of The Sims. <laughs> I see him. There he is. Hiding behind a tiny little fence. What? I'm uh, uh. looking for cover.
Yeah, I don't want that. I need to deposit this. This is a lot of money I got. I will not be insulted like that again. Next time, please inform her that we are not the same bot. The same sort of Bayou Hicks operating out of a double wide. We are highly educated scientists.